so welcome to KO tutorials so let's continue with the next part of this tutorial so let's get started so as you can see over here we have started with the modeling of this particular wardrobe and its assets so let's continue it so I have started creating this kind of clothing stuff so we have created a shirt kind of stuff over here so we can create some other clothing accessories so let's continue it so I have a reference as well so I can just open up a reference if needed we can just use this references so for that I can just go into this let's take a box so I can just go over here I can just take a box So let's just increase the height. And slightly just push this up. So we can just make a copy of it. Or I'll just convert to poly. <coughs> let's go into this. Let's put one loop over here. So let's make a duplicate of it. So let's just attach it. Select the polygons. Let's just bridge it. So select this both. So we can just chamfer this. let's put one one loop so I'll just end isolate this so I can just put one one loops over here so let's just and isolate it I can slightly rotate it slightly so scale this so we can just make such copies of this clothes over here so you can just place all of this again just duplicate it slightly just push it up I can just resize it so although it's going to be visible from one side so I'm not just creating any kind of details like creating a collar or something so if you want you can just go into this and let's give a FFD box over here so I can just slightly just add it so convert to poly and isolate it or we can just use any kind of a hanging stuff over here so for that again we can create one clothing stuff 
so for clothing we can just go over here let's just take a line line tool like this let's just <coughs> close the shape so select the vertices and slightly if needed we can give a bit of fillet so let's give uh, extrude modifier so I'll go into this slightly give extrude so we can just convert to poly so you can just select this one oh, so control and backspace to remove that right click and let's give cut So we can just use uh, this weld option, just weld it, use a cut, alright, so we can just select this and let's give one connect select this let's give one connect so select this whole thing you can slightly scale it i'm just creating very very basic i don't even have this reference i'm just creating it very basic So just go over here and let's put on the loops and let's give turbo smooth. So before we give turbo smooth, select the polygons. So other clothing accessory, I'll create it with a reference. just go over here and just use this way now what I can do is like convert to poly select this whole thing and slightly just extrude it up select this push it down select the polygons and so we can just exclude all this right from the inside and let's give bevel by local normal click ok so let's give turbo smooth and isolated So 
just scale it inside. So just push it up and drag it inside in this way. So we do have this hanger stuff. We can just duplicate it. So let's just scale it. All right. So and isolate this. So if needed, you can just uh, make the copies of it and slightly resize it if needed. Alright. So we can make the multiple copies of it. Alright. So guys, if any doubts, please put it in the comment section over here. So few accessories are left out, which will be covering it up in the coming tutorial. So please like and subscribe my YouTube channel. So thanks for watching this tutorial.